Welcome to the Learning Pads. This is the landing page for all the current learning pads. In this video, we explore spelling, pronunciation, and vocabulary. Lily's gold will be explained separately. Inside each circle, you will find the total amount of time you have spent in each learning pad since becoming a member. Directly to the right, you will find your total amount of time spent, and the total amount of words that you have practiced in today's sessions. This information is populated as you spend time and complete each module throughout the day. As mentioned in the Reading and Reading Tools video, Lily remembers and stores all your opportunity words which include, all the words you mispronounced during your reading sessions, the words highlighted in red, or the words you looked up in the dictionary, listened to or translated. Lily then combines all your opportunity words with over 3,000 of the most frequently spoken English words for you to learn. Lily is tracking your progress, and delivering all your words via a sophisticated space repetition algorithm, and over time, you will master these words during your practice sessions with Lily. Okay, each learning module is designed for a specific activity, but they all follow a similar delivery methodology, and Lily is there to guide you through all your learning sessions. At any point in the conversation, you can say help to learn all available commands, which will assist your efforts when interacting with Lily. Any word that you do not want to be tested on, can be deleted during or after the exercise by clicking the delete button. Let's begin with the spelling module. During your spelling sessions, Lily will present your words to you one at a time. Welcome, Welcome back, back James. James. You can either spell the words by typing in the text box or by saying the letters aloud. Let's take a look. Welcome back, James. Let's get started. Here is your first word out of 10. Please spell against. Well done. Please spell America. A. M. E. R. I. C. A. Extraordinary. Please spell length. Sorry. That's incorrect. I will ask you to spell length three times. James. You will need to spell length two times correctly before moving on. Please spell length. Please spell it one more time. Very good. Here is your next word. Please spell matters. Extraordinary. Please spell others. Okay, next up, pronunciation. When practicing your pronunciation do your best to pronounce each word as clearly as you can. Try not to mumble or slur your words, and ensure you are close enough to your microphone. If you get stuck on a word that is difficult for you to pronounce, you can always say skip, and Lily will move to the next word. Here is an example. Glad to see you again, James. Glad to see you again, James. Let's start. Here is your first word out of 10. Please pronounce efforts. Efforts. Great job. Please pronounce meters. Motors. Sorry. Not quite. I will ask you to pronounce meters two times. James. You will need to pronounce meters one time correctly before moving on. Please pronounce meters. Meters. Please pronounce it once more. Meters. James. I seem to be having difficulties recognizing your pronunciation of this word. Would you like to keep trying? No. Here is your next word. Please pronounce necessary. Necessary. Great job. And lastly, let's explore vocabulary. Hey James. Lily will present to you one word at a time and will ask you if you know the word. If you know the word and say yes, Lily will ask you to select the correct synonym from a suggested list. If you do not know the word, you simply tell Lily no, and she will explain it to you. 
Here is a short demonstration. Hey James. Welcome to vocabulary. Let's start. Let's talk about the word dynamic. To give you an idea how this word can be used. Here is an example. A dynamic relationship. Do you know this word? No. Not a problem. Let's learn together about this word. The word dynamic means always active or changing. Here are a couple of sentences that use this word. A dynamic city. A dynamic relationship. Here are some examples of similar words. Active, energetic, spirited, lively. Here is your next word. Let's discuss the word finish. This word can be used in a sentence such as A suspense film with a perfect surprise finish. Do you know the meaning of finish? Yes. Excellent. From the following suggestions. Please type or say the right synonym for finish. Conclusion. Lively. Ceremonial. Great job. Let's review the word formal. We hope you enjoyed the demonstrations, here are some summary tips. Remember to always wait for Lily to finish speaking before responding. When the border of the chat box turns orange, it is your turn to speak or type. At any point in the conversation, you can say help to learn all available commands. If you find you must repeat yourself or tell Lily a command more than once, try waiting one second longer to allow Lily more time to switch to her listening mode. A special note, after each lesson is complete, Lily will reveal the translation buttons next to each world on the right side. You can select any word and find out the translation if you are unsure of the meaning before moving on. Remember, the learning pads are designed to support you and not to judge you. So, if you find yourself struggling with a specific word, or are not interested in learning a word, you can simply delete it from your list by clicking the delete button. Thank you for taking the time to learn.